that was a situation where the grenades should do good. Like I should bounce them off there and down to where there's a big group of people are. Hi guys, this is Matthias coming at you here with another Farquhar Hill optical video. And yes, you'll probably see me use this weapon quite a bit because I think this is a really good gun. Now lately I've also started using the rifle grenade as one of the gadgets on my medic class which is something that I normally wouldn't do and that I actually do not really recommend. I think the medical syringe or whatever healing you prefer is better, generally speaking, but I want to just try out something new, because why not? Now, first and foremost, I haven't had all that much success with the rifle grenade, but you'll see a little bit of it here anyway. Hopefully, soon enough, I'm going to try to cover the rifle grenade a little bit better but you could consider this video a bit of a sneak peek. Now this rifle grenade is not all that powerful and it definitely doesn't have the kind of splash damage that we have been used to from certain other first person shooters in the past and actually the Battlefield series as well. Now, the fact that it isn't as powerful as we might think is in my opinion a good thing. However... Oh! Our oh, triple! Just as I said it was useless. Oh, shit. <laughs> now, one of my own personal biggest problems with playing the medic class is the fact that I have to restrain myself from just rushing f too fast forward. I normally play Assault and I normally have a far more aggressive playstyle than this, something that from time to time I have a tendency to fall back on. Now another thing that you'll probably notice in this video, especially if you have some experience with the medic class, is that I many times fire this gun a bit too fast. And what happens is of course that the weapon gets inaccurate. You want to try to maintain your cool a little bit more than what you see me doing in this video, especially in that example. I know it feels risky to kill your opponents a little bit too slowly, but uh, the fact is that if you don't, your time to kill can many times be even longer. Now the one thing I have to say about the medic class though is that the more I play it, the harder it becomes to decide what my favorite weapon is. I recently started trying out the Howl Sniper and I really liked it on certain maps. And the same goes for the M1907 SL, both the sweeper and the trench version. Oh what?! The Swedish T. See what he's writing there up in top uh, in the squad chat. Now it's only you and me. How cozy! So yeah, there's more medic gameplay coming soon, and especially more rifle grenade gameplay. So I hope you will stay tuned for that. Now I really hope you will enjoy the rest of the video. My name is Matthias, and I want to thank you all for watching. Nine. Give us some ammo, someone.
Печка, пригодится! Аптечка! Используй столбик! Аптечка! Внимание! Вижу вражеского разведчика! What sounded creepy? I'm I'm trying to figure out that it's hard to keep up with the with the chat now. Got the infiltrator. That's 
Good morning, dark side. Ghost Rider, ammo, 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 ammo. Ghost, please. Out of ammunition. We have taken the two. There, first aid. We have taken objective butter. Use that first aid. Use that first aid. Fuck. We have taken How it bounced. Battlefield, right? Or is it the other way around? We have lost objective button. Huh, he didn't go far enough with the limpet. That could have killed a lot of people. Yeah, it's easy to get obsessed with all these rifle grenades. I, I lost a lot of good ki easy kills there because of the rifle grenades. 